Hey guys, what's up? My name is Taylor Whitney. If you're new here and if you're not, welcome back to my channel. So as you guys can tell by the title, I'm going to be giving you guys 50 plus more creative things to do when you're bored. This is a continuation of a video I posted a while back titled 100 Creative Things to Do When You're Bored and you guys seem to really love that video so I decided why not give you guys a part two and give you some more fun stuff to do. The first thing on the list is to decorate your phone case. This is so much fun. Just taking like a regular clear phone case and like putting stuff in it or even painting it. Paint your skateboard or your longboard, whichever one you have. Obviously don't like paint the top part of it on the grip tape, but painting a cool design on the bottom is such a great way to customize your board and make it look cool. Recreate drawings on Pinterest. I I always love doing this even if it's just like little doodles it's fun to try and like copy them and get inspiration from pinterest make a friendship tie blanket i have made so many of these and they're all so cute and they're super easy to make as well make bookmarks this is perfect because back to school season is here We're gonna be doing a lot of reading so having a custom bookmark would be such a cool thing for that learn how to crochet as you can tell by my channel i am super big into crochet if you guys have never crocheted at all i have plenty of videos on it on my channel so if this one interests you definitely go check all of those out which leads to my next thing on the list make crochet clothes possibilities are also endless with this you can make dresses sweaters tops corset tops skirts literally anything you can think of all right guys i'm just gonna pause right here and before we continue i just want to mention that this video is sponsored by skillshare skillshare is the largest largest online community for creatives with thousands of classes led by industry experts across film, illustration, design, freelance, productivity, and more. Skillshare can help take your passions and hobbies or side hustles to the next level. There are so many class options that are available to you that can help you improve on whatever skills that you may need a little bit of extra help on. Recently, I have have been personally using Skillshare to learn more about video production so I can make better content for you guys. I have honestly been learning so much to improve my videos and speaking of improvements, Skillshare has recently created a new class system including smarter class categories and three new class topics which are creative careers, creative inspiration, and AI and innovation. Since it's back to school season it is the perfect time to download Download and get started with Skillshare. I promise you will not regret it. If this does interest you, make sure to sign up with the link in the description. The first 500 people to use my link will receive a one month free trial of Skillshare. Go start your classes today. Anyways, getting back into the video paint shells this is like a cute summer activity i know we're not in summer anymore but that doesn't matter just because we're in fall doesn't mean you can't still do summer activities recreate your favorite fast food order there are so many recipes out there for remaking literally any item from any fast food place this is a similar one recreate a starbucks drink this is also a really fun one and it's honestly such a smart idea because because then if you figure out how to make your favorite drink at home, you won't ever have to go out and order it again and spend extra money on it. Make a hair wrap. I have seen so many of these on Pinterest and they're all super, super cute. Have a digital camera photo shoot. I love doing this, especially at night with like flash photos. You can get the best Instagram pics doing this. Make a jewelry dish out of clay. This hibiscus one is super popular at the moment and it's so so cute i've seen it all over tiktok and pinterest i would definitely recreate this if i had clay but i'm all out at the moment paint your jeans such a great way to customize your clothes without like having to sew or anything you could use fabric paint or even acrylic paint and just get like a fabric medium to mix into it put ribbon on your jeans this is even easier than painting them and it is such a cute little fashion statement learn how to do nail art there are so many different nail art trends going on right now like i know stars and cheetah print is super super popular at the moment 
moment and for good reason because it's so so cute decorate sunglasses i feel like this would be such a cute little activity if you're a senior in high school and you could write like the year you're graduating on it that would be so cute clean out your camera roll this is a super productive one definitely one that i need to do i am completely out of storage on my phone i have way too many photos it's insane make book covers this is a cute way to customize the book you're reading especially if it has like an ugly title cover you could like make it all cutesy and aesthetic paint pottery this is such a cute like hangout idea with friends or as a date or it could even just be like a solo activity as well paint with bleach another great way to customize your clothes make a bikini box since we're going out of summer this is a great way to store your bikinis while you're not using them. I made one this summer though and actually don't use it for my bikinis. I have it in my car and I put all of my little car stuff in there for the beach. Start a Minecraft world with your friends. Who doesn't love doing this one? Minecraft is such a nostalgic game. I literally love it so much. I haven't played in so long. Try latch hooking. There's so many things you can make with this like pillows, rugs, throw blankets. Decorate a cowboy hat. This is a great one for like going to festivals or rodeos. It's a great fashion piece. Make an Instagram reel. And if you're wondering what you can do for that Instagram reel, film yourself doing one of these activities on the list and I guarantee it will go viral. Make a quilt. Collect sea glass and seashells. A great thing to do if you're at the beach or if you're not at the beach and you're just like on a hike or something, you could collect crystals or cool rocks instead. And then you can use them to make jewelry which is my next thing make seashell jewelry or crystal jewelry whatever it is you find when you're out exploring have a bracelet making picnic this looks like it would be so much fun i'm obsessed follow a makeup tutorial this is always so much fun especially if you're going out somewhere and you want to do like bold makeup this is a really good one to do for that bible study but make it cute bring all of your highlights and your pens and your little tabs so that way not only are you studying the Bible but you're also being creative and decorating it as well make a collage lock screen make like a little vision board for your lock screen on your phone I usually use the app Pixar for this make a reading slash study corner in the corner of your room this would be so cute to have like a little book nook or just somewhere cozy that you can sit in your room give yourself a sunscreen tattoo basically you just have to like draw something on your skin with sunscreen and then go outside and tan in the sun and then the part that's covered in sunscreen will be lighter than the rest of it or if you don't want to do this you could give yourself a henna tattoo these are always super fun I actually just did these like a month ago and I really enjoyed it I gave all of my friends henna tattoos do a paper mache craft start a wreck this journal this used to be super popular like 2016 2017 that is when I got mine and I still have not finished it make a rear view mirror hanger for your car this is a great way to decorate your car and give it a little more pizzazz paint rocks this would be a super cool one if you like painted a bunch of them and then put them in your yard and you had like a whole garden full of decorated rocks candle painting I have seen a bunch of people do this on Pinterest and it looks so like cutesy and aesthetic. Recreate photos on Pinterest for Instagram or Visco or wherever you want to post them. This is always super fun and it's what I do a lot on my Instagram. Like I get a lot of my photo inspiration from Pinterest. Next we have recreate outfits on Pinterest. I also love doing this. This is where most of my style comes from. I owe it all to Pinterest. Paint old bottles. This is a great way to recycle. Go to a farmer's market. This is a cute little activity to do and a great place to take Instagram pictures. Try rhinestone canvas art. These always look so, so cool. I've seen like eight bowl ones or martini glasses. Customize your clothes. I literally love doing this because then nobody has the same piece as you because you made it yourself. Make 
coasters. There are so many cute ways you could do this, whether it's with clay or crochet ones, or just painting existing coasters to make them custom. Accessorize your shoelaces. This is a great way to make your shoes look a lot cuter. Write letters to your friends. I feel like nobody does this anymore. Everyone just texts or calls. People don't even call these days. It's just strictly texting or using Snapchat. Decorate a picture frame. This is such a cute one. You can decorate it to like match the vibe of your room. Try punch needling. This is so cool. I've never tried it, but it looks super fun. You can make like rugs or coasters with this. And last but not least, we have make quilted eight ball pillows. Eight balls are like really trending right now and this is so, so cute. And it doesn't look all that hard to make either. So yeah guys, I think that is unfortunately going to wrap it up for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed and I hope you guys are less bored now. Let me know down in the comments if you guys try any of these things out and let me know which one you did. Also guys, definitely check out Skillshare. My referral link is in the description. Make sure you use it. But guys, if you did enjoy watching, please give this video a big thumbs up. Comment down below this emoji right here if you made it this far into the video and subscribe if you want to see more of my face in the future. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day.